Hello sexies, welcome to a new video. For today's video, I'm super excited and thrilled to show you this beautiful place that if you have the opportunity, you must visit. It's called the Hoover Dam. The Hoover Dam is a concrete arched gravity dam in the Black Canyon of the Colorado River on the border between the U.S. states of Nevada and Arizona. It was constructed between 1931 and 1936 during the Great Depression and was dedicated on September 30, 1935 by President Franklin D. Roosevelt. I can't believe that I was walking over this bridge. The bridge is called Mike O'Connell Pat Tilleman Memorial Bridge. The bridge is in front of the Hoover Dam. The Memorial Bridge Plaza and walkway is open to pedestrians with recommended safety precautions. And look at this view, it is spectacular. This bridge is the highest in the nation at 840 feet above the Colorado River. It's spectacular for viewing and photographing the magnificence of the Hoover Dam, Lake Med and the high walls of the Black Canyon. It's free to walk or drive across the Hoover Dam and the Colorado River Bridge. However, there is a charge for parking. The dam is an engineering marvel. Lake Med and the surrounding mountains are scenic. The state line marker is a popular photo op and it's fun to get a good look at. Lake Med on the other side and then wonder a huge drop down the concrete wall on the other side. Hoover Dam straddles the Nevada-Arizona state line. The road over the dam used to be part of the main highway through that area, but now it ends on the Arizona side. It is easy to spend an hour or more just walking on and around the dam itself. The Hoover Dam is located in the desert and temperatures will usually be hotter than 100 degrees in the summer. Bring plenty of drinking water with you, especially if you plan to park in the free parking on the Arizona side, which I did. You'll be walking uphill on the way back to your car. The walk across the dam is a half mile round trip. Wear sunscreen and bring a hat. Hoover Dam is located about 30 minutes from Las Vegas, just outside of Boulder City, Nevada. Okay, here we go. I am entering the Hoover Dam. Hoover Dam has a multi-level parking garage on the Nevada side and several parking lots on the Arizona side. The parking garage charges $10 per vehicle and it's the most convenient parking option for the dam. This is super interesting. So, the Hoover Dam is located on the border of Nevada and Arizona. If a visitor enters the Hoover Dam from the Nevada side, he or she is in the Pacific Standard Time Zone. By crossing the Nevada-Arizona state line in the middle of the Hoover Dam, the visitor enters a Mountain Standard Time Zone. Technically, visitors are standing in two time zones at the same time when halfway across the dam, but this only applies half the year. Arizona and Hawaii are currently the only two states that don't adhere to daylight saving times, but every state has the option to opt out. From March to November, Arizona is in PTS, not MST, which is why visitors are only in two time zones in the middle of the dam half the year. The view from this side is just amazing. I have never seen anything like this before. Being surrounded by so many mountains and nature. Oh my god, I loved it. It's 
golden hour when the sun is hitting directly to your skin. I loved visiting the Hoover Dam. Thank you so much for watching my video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more videos. Besos!